Nicole, thank you. Now to that tragic crash involving a Tampa City garbage truck. Police just revealing they will not criminally charge the truck drivers, truck driver rather, for the death of Marsha Rivers. And ABC Action News reporter Maricela Burgos live with more on what city leaders are telling us about that truck itself. Maricela, what can you tell us? The driver's boss told me that man is distraught and now under a doctor's care because police say he hit and killed a woman right here. Friends describe Marcia Rivers as a woman who loved to teach, share and learn. She was one of a kind, a huge heart, quite creative, especially with marketing. They want to know exactly what happened Tuesday morning when detectives say a city garbage truck killed her. No words can describe the loss. City leaders confirming tonight the garbage truck has a backup camera that was working. They're still investigating whether the backup warning system was working that morning as well. I'm told drivers are instructed to also honk when they back up. Tampa police detectives have yet to release specific details about the moments leading up to the crash. Late this afternoon, they confirmed Rivers was not wearing any earbuds. Rivers is a retired Hillsborough County public schools teacher. She was a bubbly personality and she enjoyed what she did. Her passion and fire for education was there. It was very evident. City officials tell me the driver is on paid leave while he won't face criminal charges. I've been told by the police department he will be given a civil traffic citation for Rivers death. Reporting live, Maricela Burgos, ABC Action News.